As you take a look at future track on this Saturday evening, clear skies that we've had tonight, they should stay with us as we go through the night. May see a few more clouds develop by morning. Then the south winds kick up on your Sunday. That's going to lead to more of a partly cloudy day. It's also going to make a much warmer day with temperatures. They're going to get into the upper 70s and as we head into Monday. Expecting uh, partly to mostly cloudy skies. That's ahead of our next system, and that one's going to cool us off in a big way. I'll show you in a little bit. First, look at the temperatures as we head into Sunday morning. We'll see them only drop down to the mid 40s across the area. Those south winds pump up the warm air. We get into the lower 70s, maybe mid 70s, upper 70s, even lower 80s across some of our western counties. And then as we head into Sunday night and the Monday morning, only dropping down to the 60s. South winds continuing. That's going to keep the humidity around. We're going to see temperatures fall into the 60s there by Monday morning. And then Monday, the west winds kick in. That may warm us up into the 80s in parts of central Texas. I think we'll be close to around 79, 78 across the I-35 corridor. But it is going to be a warm day on Monday. That changes the next day because a strong cold front arrives overnight. And we go from 43 Monday night to 45 for a high Tuesday. 60% chance of rain. It's going to be one of those days that's nasty with a cold rain dropping down to near freezing by Wednesday, and then we settle in on a colder pattern as we go into next week with temperatures staying in the 50s and the 60s, maybe a brief warm up ahead of another system later on next weekend. As a look at your updated 10 day forecast, thanks for watching First Alert 25. I'm meteorologist Josh Johns.